I'm gonna be like an F1 racer, which is like Formula One racing. If I know him well enough, he will probably go as fast as he can. If a car goes up to 150, I'll go 150. Behind the camera, there's Robbie. I'm taller than Robbie by two inches. I'm like almost 60, he's almost 63, I think. We're best friends. Moya Moya, something was wrong with the back of my head. And I found out when I was four because I went into the store to get some water for my soccer game. And I just fell down. And then I got back up and then I fell down again. Dr. Scott would tell me that it's two and one million sort of thing. My name is Dr. Michael Scott and I'm a neurosurgeon here at the Children's Hospital. What is Moya Moya? It, what it is is a disease that causes the blood vessels that carry blood to the brain to squeeze down and narrow down and they shut off the blood supply to the brain. You know, the arteries are the, are the blood vessels that bring blood from the heart up to the brain. Here is the blood coming up in the artery in, in the brain on the left side. And see how it's nice and black? That means there's good blood flow in it. And then when it gets up here into the brain, it narrows down to a tiny little point and there's just a teeny little bit of blood getting out this way and this way. These little lines here, those are some of the, the Moya Moya blood vessels. When you did my surgery, yeah. how long did it take? Oh, it took about eight hours or it took all day. I have like two metal um, place in my head? Yeah. And what was that for? We had to drill holes to expose the brain mm -hmm. and then we put that artery down on the brain surface and we stitch it to the brain to keep it there so it sticks to the brain mm -hmm. and it can grow new blood vessels yep. and then we put the bone back so that's mm -hmm. what the metal plates are for. Mm -hmm. They hold the bone in so it's good and strong. And here again is that artery that we use for the operation and see all these squiggly lines here they're all the new blood vessels that yep. are growing into the brain there again that's a sign of a very successful operation i'm glad that i had the surgery because i know that if i didn't have it that um i would be in a wheelchair Thank you. i can do everything that a normal kid can do thanks to dr scott if i didn't get the surgery done I couldn't run, I couldn't play all the sports I do. It really had an impact on me since I've been doing all of these walks and fundraisers. And then we'll put the money in that we raised into Children's Hospital. And I just keep on trying to help Children's Hospital since they helped me. I forgot a little bit of what I was going to say, but I think I did good.